Hi guys, welcome back or welcome if you're new here. It's a very wet and blustery day in the beer winds. Um, if you've been around here for a while, you know this is one of my favourite mountain ranges um, of all time, probably. I do really love it up here and I was wondering where to go this weekend and thought I'd come up here, see if there's any snow, there's none that I can see and yeah, just go for a lovely walk in the countryside. Uh, we'll also visit the waterfall which is the highest waterfall in England and Wales. It's called Llanvaida Waterfall. It's about 80 metres, I believe. But yeah, so just join me on the adventure today and like and subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, we'll just have an enjoyable day, whatever the weather brings. Um, I'm not too sure where we're going yet or where we're going to make it to just because of yeah it's not looking very promising outside it looks really really rainy and there's also a wind warning so we'll see where we get to today we'll see what happens no promises today <laughs> just started making my way up the valley onto the top and it's so busy today so much busier than it usually is um, but yeah nice to see some people outside I guess although I'm kind of missing that solitude but I'm sure we'll see those people as we carry on up into the Berlin Mountains been down to those before. I'm debating going down today, but we'll see. There's not really any plan today. The plan today is more just get out and enjoy the outside really. That's how cold it is at the moment. Anybody wondered. As we've climbed higher and higher, I haven't seen anybody now. <laughs> no one up here. You can see all up into the bay winds. The bare sprinkling of snow up there. But yeah, as I said. Today I just want, really wanted to get outside, kind of brush off the cobwebs. I think it's, um, I don't know, it's hard sometimes when you spend all week in work and you kind of have to snap out of that and get outside and remind yourself that work's not your life. I definitely think it's important to be a hard working person have a good work ethic but at the same time just doing the things you love the things you enjoy making sure that you stay connected to nature I think nature can be very grounding and also very humbling <laughs> I definitely found that for the last year being on YouTube I felt quite confident and then I was going out and recording these videos, the more I realised how much I've got left 
left to learn and left to do. Let me know as well if you've got any New Year's resolutions this year, any plans or goals, I'd really love to hear them. So make sure you leave a comment if you want to share oh gosh it's getting very icy now Columns. So, if we were to go up, we'd be following this ridge and then going over the top. But I just met someone coming down and he said it was really, really icy. I don't think I'm going to do that today. So I've actually got some clips of me being here. Um, I think it's one of the first videos I did. Um, I think it was February or March last year and I came up here and it was even colder than this. Although it is very cold, I don't think it's that cold today, uh, especially down here because it's like a little bit more sheltered and I'm out of the way, but according to this man I bumped into, it is Baltic on top and like everywhere it's a nice sheet. So I think we'll just stay down here. some photos. Um, I'll insert them here if I do take some good ones and if not I might insert the ones I took last year because I absolutely loved those photos. I thought they were some of the best that I've actually ever taken in some senses just because of like the cold and I did some of the waterfall as well last year and there was like these huge icicles hanging down. It was amazing but I'll insert them if I can some hot coffee, have a snack and then yeah just maybe take some photos. So I've decided to put my balaclava on. I'm absolutely freezing and my hat's soaking wet now. Um, so I think I'm gonna head back down. I'm gonna just crouch down here like a mountain troll. So I've just made it back to the car. I practically ran down the mountain. <laughs> I started to get so cold up there when I stopped to take some pictures and just have some snacks and things that I was just really feeling cold so I walked really fast on the way back just to get back to the car so I could finish off some hot coffee and yeah just get dry. Uh, it wasn't really raining but there was like quite a lot of moisture in the air so um, I, I'm a little bit wet from that but thank you so much for watching this far if you have and I hope you enjoyed this and it's inspired you to just get out and try something new or get out in the countryside or maybe even come here and um, do the Berwyn hike. It's really beautiful, especially in the summer. I might actually come back and do a wild camp here in the summer. So let me know if that's something you'd like to see. Also, I'd be really interested to know what people 
prefer to watch like do people prefer while camping or hiking as I've got some things in the works and some things planned and some things I want to do for this year on YouTube but I'd be interested to know kind of what everybody's thoughts and feelings were so let me know in the comments and yeah I'll see you in the next one